Hi, Rich Garuba for BowlingBall.com. You know, today let's talk about how to make a good bowling slide. You know, sometimes we overlook a really important factor of taking a good bowling approach, and the bowling slide is certainly one very key component of maintaining good balance and helping you make a good release uh, when you arrive at the foul line. So let's talk about some specifics that can help you with a bowling slide. First, we want to make sure that your balance is good. And how do you do that? Well, make sure you're not going too fast and out of control with your footwork to the foul line. You know, you can develop good ball speed with the rapid footwork, but they must be well balanced. Uh, if the steps are taken way too quickly, uh, quickly, that is, you could lose or sacrifice good body posture, and we don't want that. And next, we want to make sure that your sliding step will be in a well-balanced position as you arrive at the foul line so your weight can be transferred completely from the step before your slide with your balance leg onto the slide step. And you want to make sure you hold your knee flex uh, and your body posture as you slide into the foul line and try to avoid at all costs any sudden movements with your body torso. The upper body, including your head and shoulders, we want that to remain as stationary as possible as you make your bowling release. That critical release uh, depends on, it, a lot of good things happen when you're in good position. You can control the distance or the launch angle from the release of the ball to the targeting arrow. You can control the uh, ball speed. You can control the uh, amount of loft onto the lane. And of course, the important actual releasing action with your bowling hand itself. All that if you have a stable position at the foul line. Your sliding shoe, uh, as you transfer the weight onto that slide leg, uh, try to make sure that the toe goes into the foul line as straight as possible. You know, nothing's perfect. Some bowlers are a little bit toed in. Some bowlers toed out the opposite way. Uh, however, as long as you're within reason of being fairly straight and that step slide as close as you can comfortably and consistently to the center line of your body will give you the best balance and the best chance of making a good bowling release. So I hope some of those tips help you. You want to get to the lanes and practice of that as much as possible. If you have any questions, we highly recommend that you consult with a certified coach, uh, perhaps a local bowling professional in your area that can watch you bowl, uh, help you with your tips. Uh, and remember, to, to recap this, it all starts with a good setup. You want to be in a good body position, an athletic position when you set up and try to maintain that same good body posture all the way to the foul line so your torso, your head and shoulders remain motionless as you're sliding and releasing the bowling ball. Keep that step underneath the center of your body, slide straight into the foul line, and keep your eyes on your target. We hope that helps you. While you're here, take a little time to browse our site if you find some interesting products and perhaps something you wish to purchase. Simply follow the easy-to-order online instructions. Remember, our store is always open, and we thank you for visiting BowlingBall.com.